blue. <coughs> Sorry. Sorry. Barkless. Stop. Right. I think there's only this is nation mission step now. You meant no disrespect by rolling up to me and singing into my face. I need to. Yep. I always need to check if my mic is actually working. I draw distance on the shadows. It hurts my eyes. One of our family's allies is harassed all the time by a merchant of the Soderini family. Eliminate him without her knowledge. I do not want to frighten her. Maybe it was a torch uh, thing or something. Right. I think she noticed I was there. Lovely.
God damn it, that's you. So it's better to get a bird's eye view of things. Really? with his music. This is not the standard Venice tune. May wellness remain your companion, friends. Um, is there a painter nearby? This one there. Kind of wanted it to be on the way to the assassination spot. We can't get what we want. Although this game, the world is fairly small in comparison to many others. This is just treasure chest, so I can get that another time. Now we get a trophy for buying paintings from both Venice and Florence. That's nice. He deserved it. Promise. Trying to find your way in Venice is like trying to find your way out of the Minotaur's maze. I need a string. I apologize. Please let me remove myself. Yes, please remove yourself from my side. Played amongst the people. The Doge has decided to send a number of trusted administrators to rile the population of Florence. Apparently they are meeting the Doge shortly. Find them and kill them before the meeting before without them noticing. Awesome. Hey Bill, hey Bill. Right. I think it's quickest to actually 
swim. No, you fool. Really? You can't climb that? I don't see how that was any different. I honestly don't. I doubt I will manage this. I will. Uh, that's closer. I doubt you will put me anywhere, so. Expert, it is dangerous, but I'm an expert of falling down. Honest thief. One of my contacts in the under underworld. Yeah. Has found a conspiracy towards the Venice filial affiliate of the Medici Bank. Meet my man, a fickle thief, and follow him follow him to the target, which you then will eliminate.
No. No. There's a lot of archers here. to kill anyone. I think I once failed a mission like this because the person I was following died. Come on, man. is to be advised there and now I have to run all the way there again from here awesome but I do think it picks the pigeon coop that is closest to the starting point Instead of the one farthest away. So that's nice. Have you lost all reason? See, he would have probably fallen there. Why are you up here? Leave. We are leaving. Don't you worry. Don't you worry, pal. There, on him. There. <laughs> Back from me. Ezio, please! Poor man. <laughs> At least he didn't die from a fall.
I only have three left. I do love this game, I do love this game, I do love this game. Oh boy, oh boy. Ezio, why couldn't you just grip the edge or something? I want no part of this. Carne fresca! Salve fresca! Mm. Of course not. That would be too easy. <clears throat> The laughter in the throat. I don't know if that's a good translation or not. Several of Archbish Archbishop Salviati's co-conspirators are trying to hide from the from justice. They have took a, taken advantage of the carnival and dressed as harlequins. Find them, blind them, celebrate celebrators, and eliminate them, Lorenzo. Supposed to be able to do uh, a leap of faith into the water, but I have no idea how. Probably gonna fall off the edge. Just let me go. I'm nobody, not important. Trying to kill the person running away.
What was that? Do you mean you don't like that lady? I think I should try to do this more cleanly. I don't think you can do it cleanly then. Are you gonna go inside here yet? Scars come from. Oh no, I've led them right to the thieves' den. I think, yeah, <laughs> a bad friend. Places here are. So a lot of feathers. I think three more. Thousand different missions. the hay bale. How do you do the leap of faith into the water that I don't get? Oh. 
Attenzione. Crash. One of Francesco de Pazzi's cousin is owning a part is ordering is throwing a party. Get to the party site and shadow a guest. Why shadow a guest? Shadowing a guest. Once there, kill the host. I'm I'm convinced the guests won't miss him, Lorenzo. This might be the following music. Or she, as it were, in this case. Where? What's his problem? Why can't he walk like everyone else? I have a hip condition. Somewhere on a rooftop, there's a hero in the mood. Fear him not less, you who have seen, for his cause is good. You're not good. Go away. Thank you. I think I found the part site as it is red on the map. Um, well, how are you? Oh. 
Ta-da! Good, good. There's no one dead here. Why do you need to get out? Did you kill someone? Go away, Bard. Die of your property. Anyway, a Venetian condottieri has kidnapped a number of artists and met, forcing them to depict him as a war hero. Don't let him twist the story in such a cruel manner. Kill him. I'm con I will contact the artists afterwards. My family tomb is in need of a decoration, Lorenzo. Hopefully he's not going to kill the artists. They're innocent. On my way. Thanks for the follow, Rick Diddy. Pressing down, don't climb up. Ah, it's a lot of gods. Yeah, he's... The Ezio games are my favorite of the classic Assassin's Creed games. Keep saying it, but it's the truth. Actually controls a bit math. Yeah, I did that too. That is a great movie. Embers. Uh, the Ezio collection actually comes with both Legacy and Embers. Oh God. No, don't jump back into the smoke, Ezio. Oh 
Oh no, they killed the ladies. Could they? Leave me alone. <gasps> I need a hay bale. Or just run far enough away from him. But yeah, Embers is a really good movie. Because it has everything. Legacy, however, is not as good, but that's because it's live action and the acting is a bit stiff. But the production value is pretty good considering it's just a short movie in three parts or four parts. And they are green screening everything. So. <coughs> Quite the feet. Am I running the wrong way again? Why did I pick that pigeon coop? It's on the other side of the water. Thank you. Right. Hunt the hunter. You have not... Your work has not been... Has not been passed by. Someone with powerful friends is after you. Find and kill the targets. Hopefully he can give you clues. Defeat your pursuers. Defeat your pursuer if you find him. Then you will be safe, Lorenzo. I'm going down, you fool. No. Thank you. Wait. It's better to go down. Running takes a lot of time in this. Running takes a lot of time usually, but traversing is a bit difficult when you can't call the horse. But that was a big one of the big changes in Brotherhood is that you can ride your horse inside the city. It's revolutionary. For the sailors. I see my target. Yeah. <laughs> 
theft was successful. I killed him. I don't think that's called theft. That's robbery. Or a robbery gone wrong? I'm sorry. I just bumped into you. Oh, don't bump into them. They will kill them. Moving my thumb. But Ezio has the most exciting journey of all the AC characters, in my opinion. Bayex is also pretty good, and so far, Cassandra has a good one as well. But Altair is just a bit dull. And Connor is also a bit dull because I don't know. Kenway Edward is so and so. For goodness sake, don't break on me now, controller. I think I need to climb up uh, Better for you to die cleanly now, traitor. <laughs> traitor? Who have I betrayed? betrayed? him. Oh, uh, come on. Oop, yeah, right, I forgot you can do first person. I completely forgot about that. I think we're done with the... Uh, yep. All the assassination missions are done. Yeah. But, I mean, in the most recent ones, Odyssey and Origins, I feel like they are. Because it's always about revenge, isn't it? Or redemption. In uh, the first. Altair wants to redeem himself in the eyes of Al Muelim. In Ezio's entire arc, it's about revenge. Or something. Like, two, revenge for killing his family. Brotherhood, revenge for killing his family. Three. Well, three is. Or three. I mean, Brotherhood Revelations is. More of a journey of discovery, rather than just a revenge story. Three is revenge for killing Connor's family. Four is just pirating the pirate's life. And three is also a bit of revenge. Origins is revenge. Odyssey is.
discovery and revenge? I don't know. Revenge is a very big theme in Assassin's Creed games anyway. Right. Uh, let's find the closest... Ah, oh, we're right by the bridge. But where though? Here it is. By order of the Doge himself, don't carry Let's go back to Monte Rigioni. Right, let's see. Must be excluded from all mercantile enterprise. And Monte Rigioni. Accept. Oh, I'm gonna sh switch out the cape as well to the standard one. Uh, yeah, I know it's useless. Sorry. Come and get the I ought to uh, uh, weapons. Should I buy every ooh yeah? Thank you. Come again. Altair's sword is the best sword in the game. And I tend to only use swords. Good to see you, Ezio. Care for a bit of practice? Yes, please. Uh, I think... All of these we know. And these you can buy. Let's see it another time. One more and we'll be done! Such skill, such grace. I never used that. Shoot, probably. Dead. Well done, Ezio. <coughs> you kind of need to do that for a trophy. Let's see it another time. One more time, Ezio. <gasps> Such skill. Such <laughs> I didn't even do it.
I think that's it. Yeah. Yes, it's best we take a break. Let's take the money off the coffer. Go up and put in some feathers. I think we just have two. Now we have all the paintings. Feathers in the chest. Yeah, I don't have all the feathers. I'm not going to do all the feathers on stream because me running around trying to find feathers is not going to be that exciting. Leonardo! Ezio, so good to see you. How can I help you? Haha! -ha! You found another one! How exciting! Yeah. This one's easy. You just move every other letter. Here. And next, we're gonna go down to the sanctuary. Sanctuary. I will. Be right back with you. So these are six famous assassins and Altair and they are actually, two of them are actually in the Origins and Odyssey, one in each, which is exciting because it means it's a callback of sorts. And I think I'm the only one who remembered. At least from my friends. Mayor of Monteregioni. I have 8% of And now we have Altair's armor. Thank you, Altair, for this great gift. May it shield me from my enemies. Now, why Altair had. Something that looks like Renaissance clothing, I do not know. But here we have all the armors. Every armor is missing a piece because I decided not to go with the chest piece because fashion. Here we have the flying machine, the cart. And here you can alter from the different armor sets if you want. Sorry. Which is nice. So let's do this thing. It is time, Uncle. Let us finish what you and my father started all those years ago. Indeed. Perhaps now we can finally make sense of this prophecy and put a stop to whatever it is the Spaniard is plotting. 
We should start by locating the vault. The codex pages will lead us to it. Let's take a look. Uh, the cross on the map. I don't know why I'm translating that. Rodrigo Borgia, aka the Spaniard. A dark stain on human history, Rodrigo left a trail of blood a mile wide on his quest to unify Italy under the Templar banner. Anyone who opposed him ended up in little pieces inside a sack, or, if he was in a good mood, poisoned. Once he was crowned Pope, Rodrigo, or should I say Alexander VI, used his influence to wage war with any city that held out against the Templars. And then there were the rumoured X-rated atrocities. Hundreds of courtesans brought to the Vatican by the cartload, and the Pope's close friendship with his illegitimate daughter, Lucrezia. Oh yeah, and did I mention the killings never stopped? Throughout all his public debauchery, Rodrigo was quietly murdering his enemies behind the scenes, consolidating Templar power for the moment when they would seize control. I think it's funny that Rodrigo Borgia plays a big part in this and there's also the TV series The Borgias. I think it came out roughly at the same time so it was a bit of a Borgia craze. So this is a puzzle, really. Or puzzle, it's arranging them correctly. They don't really move them, they are in order. It's all about making them fit. Uh, see. This is a map to all the wall, walls, I think. I should probably read the codex pages as well. Should I do that? Actually, let's do that in the menu. Uh, is it database? Page one. Now I have spent days with Artifact, or weeks, months, I'm not entirely sure anymore. The others came now and then, offering food and other relaxation. They told me I should take a break from my studies. Malik has suggested that I should leave them entirely, but I'm not ready yet to defect. I must understand this apple of Eden, I must. Is it a weapon? Uh, I don't know that word. I'm gonna quickly do a Google Translate. Uh, Swedish. A list? Can it be both? The one who... Uh, the one who increases his knowledge also increases his sorrow. I can relate, I can really relate to the meaning of this. But that should be true. Literally? Literally? A community armed with ideas and information instead of steel and sword. Its function is simple. Elementary, in fact. Mastery. Control. But the process, the method, and the means, they are fascinating. The one, the people, 
The ones who are exposed to its light are promised all that they wish. It only asks for one thing in return, complete, complete obedience. And who can resist? It's pure and clean temptation. I remember my own weakness when I confront when I was confronted by Al Mualim. His sword has lowered my confidence. He who had been a father to me, now my worst enemy. A moment's doubt was all he needed to get under my skin, but I defeated the phantoms, rebuilt my confidence, and removed him from this world. I fought myself to freedom, but now I wonder, did I really? Uh, here I am, in desperate need to understand what I once swore to destroy. The reason, the apple has a story to tell, and I can feel how it how it gl glistens with power and danger. I don't know if this is this way, but like electricity. That's the word I'm looking for. How electricity pops or something. We have all been exposed. It is my duty to do something about it. I mustn't, I can't stop until I've found the truth. Page two. No text, soon to be able to see the image. So this is the crusade, the Templars versus the assassins. Or the Templars lay siege to the place where the assassins are. Uh, yeah. Page three. No text. Soon to look at image. The hidden blade. Or the construction of the hidden blade. Page four. That leads us to the three tenets of the Assassin Order. We strive for peace, but murder is our means. We try to open people's mind, but demand obedience to rulers and rules. Three, we want to show the, the danger of blind faith, but we are ourselves believers. Something. I have no satisfactory, satisfactory answer to these accusations, only speculations. Are we bending the rules for a higher purpose? And what, is, what does that say about us? That we are liars? That we are hypocrites? That we are weak? I'm constantly fighting with these conjectures and by, and despite all the years that has passed, I have not been able to find a suitable answer. I fear that us, that such does not exist. Nothing is, nothing is true. Everything is permitted. Is it our creed that is the answer? Is it possible to be two opposite things at the same time? And why not? Am I not myself proof to this? We, with our noble pretexts and barbaric methods, <clears throat> we who celebrate the purity of life and then promptly execute the ones we'll see as enemies. Page 5. Who were they, the ones who came before? What made them come here? How long ago? Centuries? Decades? No, that's wrong. Millennia. Even more. So few traces of them. What made them go away? What are these objects? Hidden messages? Tools used to guide us? Or are we fighting the power of old junk? Watching, seeing something divine in things that are thro th thrown away toys. 
Sorry, I can't read. Page 6. Robert de Sable may be dead, but his brotherhood lives. They are less conspicuous, but just as much a threat. Instead of be like before, wandering, in, wandering with pride on the open street, which made them easier targets, they now work in the dark. It gets harder to find them. What... What's that word? I'd probably just need to have Google Translate open. Because that's a fancy word. And I'm not really... That. Abominations. What abominations are planned in the cover of darkness? Our work gets harder. There's already rumors about the movement in Cyprus. I need to... I need to investigate. They may, it has made me realize that our methods must change. No more fortresses, no more spectacular stagings of offensive of public executions. We must spin our webs in silence, and we must do it in other ways than in the past. I pray that my brothers abandon their rituals, but not the creed. That is what, that is what made, makes us assassins. Not the, remover, the removing of fingers, not false promises about paradise, not the for no, not forbid. Um, not the ban of poison. Our duty is to serve the people, not the customs. And if we need to prowl, we prowl. Do we need to take poison? We do. If our blades can be used without cutting off our fingers, they shouldn't. And if we can manipulate and if we can't manipulate our and we can't manipulate our initiates with lies and deceits. We must we must speak direct and honest. We will rise again. Page seven. <coughs> I would have thought that Ada would re lead me to the others, but I would, that I would have, that I would put my weapons aside and live a normal life. By now I know that there is no room for such dreams. Her face, I would try to hunt it, not hunt it, uh, push it out of my mind. The memories of those days and nights I hunted over the, across the seas after the Templar that captured her. I almost made it in time, almost. If I only had been quicker, instead I have a lifeless body in my arms. See the terror in her stiff, staring eyes. I found them, one at a time, until all the responsible were dead. But I found no joy in this, no satisfaction, no relief. The death did not give her life did not heal my wounds. After that I was convinced that I would never learn that I would never get to know another woman that I knew her. Luckily I was wrong. Page 8 Why are our instincts so set to violence? I study the uh, cooperation <laughs> between different species. Their survival their survival instincts seems to flourish seems to nourish the death of others. Why can't they walk hand in hand? There are so many that believe the world is created by divine power. But I only see a concoction of a sick fool celebration to destruction and despair. We are born of chaos without intent. Goals and meaning only a product of the passing of time. 
first something nature forced upon us, then something we we took upon ourselves. Page nine. Every meaning seemed to be repeated. Every meaning that is repeated for long enough and hard, loud enough eventually becomes a solid point, a truth. Uh, given that, given of course that you are, uh, that you can survive the opposition and silence the ones who think differently. But if you are to succeed and dispatch all opposition, then all that remains is, per definition, the truth. Is there any truth in an objective sense? No. But how do you reach a objective standpoint? The answer is you don't. There's literally, it's literally, literally, physically poss impossible. There are too many variables, too many details and circumstances to account for. We can try, of course. Take, take us closer and closer to a revelation, but we'll never reach it. Never. Ever. I've thus come to... Uh, I've thus... come to the realization that the Templars that remains will always will try to shape the reality by their own will <laughs> shape reality by their own design they're determined they are aware that objective truth does not exist or that it is that even if it is we are hopelessly incapable of realizing it Instead, we are try they are trying to create their own explanation. This is the guiding star towards their new world order. To reshape the, the... To reshape the world in their own image. It's not about artifacts. Not about people. These are only tools. It's about ideas. Clever. Because how are you going to wage war against an idea? It's a perfect weapon. It lacks phys a physical body and can just as well change the world around us in innumerable, if not always violent, ways. An idea can't be killed. Even if you kill all the supporters, all their texts, you will only buy space or time to breathe I don't know one day it will be revived by someone reinvent reinvented I suspect that even that even we the assassins find simply has rediscovered an order older than the old one itself himself God Reading and translating is not easy. No text suits the image. Uh, it's the apple of Eden. And someone using it, I guess. Yeah, no. Page 11. Atis. Dionysos. Horus. Krishna. Mithra. Jesus. Tales of their lives bear many similarities. Too many similarities. Divine birth, prosecution, uh, followers. Um, no, that's not the word. Disciples. Why is the word for the followers of Jesus the twelve something something? Miracles, resurrection. How is this possible? Maybe it isn't. Only one and only the one and same tale told through the millennia and altered in the same way so our in and altered in the same way as our language and tools. 
is the tale on built on fact or fiction both can these figures be one and the same people person one and the same people oh my god their lives are extended and changed by an item of eden al muallim spoke of jesus as a real person a mortal that has mastered the art of manipulation but well, what is he what if he was wrong if these really existed if they really walked among us many times before does this mean that they shall come again that they are here now so many questions more for every day page 12 no text soon to see image uh, the solar system I suspect because there's a sun in the middle a heliocentric solar system before that guy page 13 <coughs> the hidden blade has been our constant companion throughout years some would even claim that with, we are this knife and they would not be wrong a lot of our success had been impossible without it but it has been become aged and I therefore sought to make improvements more than just uh, uh, remove the demand to cut off your finger in order to use it the first edition is a metal disc that can be used to parry parry thrusts and slashes other assassins will think it's thinks it is designed by a new metal and it gives me the honor to have made the blueprint here, here given here on the arc it's best if they don't know the truth. Me and Malik has also sought after new ways of assassination from the air, from ledges and hiding places. Simple movements, but of the most importance. The third and final edition is the simplest of them all. A second blade, identical to the first. And if, if an assassin is forced to face two targets he only need to wait for a moment when he can strike at both at the same time these blades will be in a limited supply the metal they are forged of is hard to get i need to seriously consider who will be given the right to carry two page 14 the human is trying to master all that comes in our way I suspect it's of unnatural force, not force, uh, drive. But it should not, but it should not be put upon other people. Every day that pass, every day that passes, more are forced to submission by trickery and violence. Others, not so uh, subjugated, are made to are made to see their lives as worthless. I've seen how men are. I've seen how men go at women. He heard the cruel words and meet people from other places. Seen how they feel and treat others. Make see how they may see how they see how they that feel and act differently are made to suffer I'm sorry as I said I'm translating as well as reading so <clears throat> we often speak of these things while we look out look out from the turrets of Masyaf. 
how can this be stopped? How can we nurture equality and tolerance? Some days we talk about education in the belief that knowledge will save us from immorality. But when I walk the streets and see how the slaves are sent to auction and get cold, my heart grows cold. I see a man throw cast words that's the words um, I know these words but they are not popping up in my head slanders uh, jeers taunts jeers yeah. I've seen a man when I see a man jeer at his wife Claiming he o she only exists for him, I clench my fist. When I see children that are forced from their parents and for another man's profit, sent for to sent to suffer and die underneath the desert sun, these are the days I do not think that talking will change anything. These are the days that I only think of how the perpetrators deserve to die. Page 15. No text, soon to see image. Cyprus. I suppose. Yes, yeah, Cyprus, it says on the page. Page 16. The apple can do more than show the path. past. In the shifting, glittering inner, I've sensed the what is yet to come. A sense what is yet to come. Something like that should not be possible. But maybe it is. Maybe it's only opportunity. How can you know? How can you be? How can you be certain? I think about the implication of the visions. Are these images of what is to come, or is it only a possible future? Can we? Uh, affect the outcome can we do we dare try and and in so doing are we only staging what is what we have seen I'm torn as always between action and passivity uncertain of which if any I can do to uncertain of which if any that which can do any difference. Can I do any difference? But I take these notes. Isn't that a try to change or to determine what I've seen? Page 17. Of all the higher, of all I've seen, nothing tells me more than the image of flames. Flames so high they are cutting through the sky. The earth trembled and shook. The mountain split open and cracked. Giant metallic towers and shards. The what's inside spread across the land. And everywhere sh screaming. And screaming everywhere. A choir is so abominable that I can yet hear its echoes. What is this madness? Is it them, I ask myself, the ones who came before? Was it like this they disappear into the fire, down into the dust? Maybe it's this destructive force that the Templars are after, so they can keep, so they can hold it against us and demand subjugation. What hope would remain if they had such a darkness in their hands? If they could murder our world. Page 80. We are forced to remain hidden. To be silent. That in, to in secret shape history. A few of. A few of my brothers and sisters do not agree. They are angry and claims that we are making this making a mistake are uh, acting in the in the hidden 
they say that it slows down our work, but they do not see the risk. To expose ourselves now would be dangerous. I fear that we would be branded as lunatics and get arrested. That is what's happening. That is what's happening. What's always been happening. If there's anything I'm certain about, it's that humans do not learn by hearing. We must see for ourselves. Make conclusions by ourselves. And if I tell anyone to be kind, tolerant, open, my words will be only witter and die far, far before they do any work. A giant waste. That's why, that's why we must continue like this. I'm sorry if I stumble on my words, but it's difficult. The legends, le <laughs> the legends tell about a golden fleece. Can the two of them be connected? I have further refined the metallic, the metal work, and devised a new kind of armor that the world, ha the world has never, never seen. It holds tremendous force, but it's so light that it's hardly noticeable. I shift between admir admiration and terror. We have created something that doubtless will give the war a new lookout. Some of them will make its wielder almost instructable. Maybe it was a mistake to create it. It's viruses to destroy the blueprints. What if they end up in enemy hands? The risk is too great. Page 20. I have studied the heathen creeds of old, the one that predates the obsessions of later, of more recent times, the obsession of most of reason of one divine creator. They seem to be more interested in the fundamental power play in the world around us than of uh, moral guidelines, something moral guidelines. The sun rises and the moon the sun rises in the morning and sets in the evening. The tide rises and fall. The grass grow wither die and rise after time and rise after time again off out of the ground the air becomes hot and then cold and then hot again and a hidden force keeps us at on the ground and pulls us back when we try to leave it that's gravity page 21 Oh, you can zoom on these. Oh, I did not know that. Sorry. You can extract many things from the plan. You can make extracts from many of the plants around here. Traders and travelers can sometimes provide more exotic species with but the properties of these plants are not as well documented and demands further research. Traditional alchemic tools can be used to provide to produce the toxin. Carefulness is to be advised that when <laughs> as some poison can then some poison can pierce the skin. Many are those that lost their lives through carelessness. The blade should be hollowed out as instructed. Anomalies can hurt the metal and lead to the blade being weakened and breaking. Page 22. This is the earth. What to believe of this map? 
it looks like it contains the entire world. Not as flat as it's been claimed, but round, like the apple. But how can something like this be possible? Stranger is that the land masses it shows, vast unknown territories, uncharted. So many places to discover. Are there people? Are they like us? And if not, how are they different? I would love to know the answer. Maybe I will, maybe I will in time get the, oppo get the opportunity to travel, set course to these distant shores. Page 23. No text. Zoom to see image. Uh, oh, these are the parkouring of the assassins. I guess. Page 24. There are days that there when I miss my family, or the thought of them anyway. I never knew my parents that well, even though we both lived in th within these walls. That's how it was. Maybe they carried a sorrow, but they never showed. It wasn't allowed. For my own part, the biggest part of the my... As for me, the biggest part of my of growing up went to study and training. Not much time was given to think about the separation. And when I finally lost them, it was almost like two strangers pa passed away. Al Mulim had been like a father, and his love was weak and unhonest. But at that time, it was for me, yeah. It was. It was for me even better. At least that's what I thought. One day I will have children of my own, as is the custom in our order, but I will not make the same mistake, nor will anyone who calls himself assassin. We will be allowed to love our children and get love in return. Anwar Lim thought that these bonds would make us weaker, make us stumble when our lives were at, when our lives were at stake. But if we really fight for what is right, is it the thought of the next? Doesn't ma the thought of our of our children make the sacrifice easier? Something. Page twenty-five. Maria. I know the answer now. I know the truth. I will never again touch that damn thing. Best if no one else does it either. Does it too. Never ever. I finally try to destroy it, but it can't be twisted, crushed or melted. The ironic thing is the ironic the irony is The irony is that I am sure the apple will explain how to do it, should I ask. But even if... But even this promise is not enough. It's, it has constantly another gift to give. I must control myself. It will be hidden away. We take it to the island. Once there, it's now, now it's now ours. There's a hidden... Sh there's a hidden treasure chamber there, and that will be enough. It's risky of me to do this and give the others give others the opportunity to find it. Far more risky to keep it. In time I will be tempted I will be tempted. I'm weak. We're all weak. Oh these things I've seen. The tale is there inside the text, not between the lines but within, but underneath them. Only where our, only where our, only where our eyes reach. Go look for yourself, so that you may succeed where I and others have failed. Time will pass, and with it comes new discoveries and insights. One day the door will open, and the message will be received. They will get their profit. I need to take up drink of water because my throat is getting sore.
Yay. Sorry. If you don't like people drinking. What, did I just read this? No. Page 27. We grow. Every day that passes there are more for every day more finds the way to our fortresses. Men and women, old as young, from different countries, with different beliefs, all telling a similar story of how they came to see the first tenant of the creed, that nothing is true. But all too often the revelation breaks them. They lose moral, conviction, security. A lot of them go, grows insane. We must guide them, help them heal. Their minds must not be filled with more fairy tales, but with knowledge. Let them get answers, and let the answers be difficult and complex, as life itself. Page 28. The Pistol. Success! We have found a way to change the structure of the hidden blade and let it fire small projectiles. It can even cause great harm, even at a distance. I admit the way I made the discovery is, uh, is risky, to say the least. But I discovered that in small doses and with a sharp mind you can use the apple without side effects. At least, I hope. Through our neighbors in the east we have knowledge of projectile battle, but these weapons are a lot bigger and useless to us. I have found a way to, dimin to minis minuscule, mini miniaturize their apparatus, made their firepower, fire weapons small enough to fit around the wrist. We have also changed the recipe for the burnable powder. Now it is enough to mix with ordinary ingredients. These is, this is dangerous knowledge that we are best to leave to our closest allies to partake. Sorry about the bad English. I did try. A darkness has, has risen in the east. An army was an army which size and strength make the ground tremble. Its leader, its leader is a man by the name Temujin with the title Genghis Khan. With the title of Genghis Khan, he sweeps he swoops across the world and conquers and subjugates all in his path. Despite what. No matter what drives him, he must be stopped. Were I younger, I would take this secret. I would take this secret. I suspect that a item of Eden is in use, but those days are past. It's time to... Something... Uh, Uh, what's the word? Pass over, but it's not pass over. It's like give over, but it's mantle. I'm sorry, I can't translate it. She and I must spo speak with our sons. We travel there together and tr test them. This must end. I'm gonna try to translate that. Sorry. It's time to hand over. Hmm, maybe. Page 30, the last page. Soon I shall leave this world. My time is past. All my waking hours are now marked by the thoughts that this insight has brought. I know that my body shall return to the earth, 
But what will happen to my conscience? My identity? What happens to me? I suspect that it will end, that there are no afterlife or rebirth. An end. Yes, an end. An end forever. A life also fickle and unimportant. What does the universe care about us? And what have we done? What if I have acted in evil instead of good? What if I had acted in evil instead of good? If I had chosen to not misuse, abuse the apple instead of closing, instead of shutting it in? It hadn't made any difference. Nothing count. Nothing counts. There is no final judgment. There's only silence and darkness. Final and complete. So I begin to think. Can this be? Can this be stopped, or maybe, or just slow down? The moment of time. The moment of death. The ones who came before was just, was hardly as weak and fla frail as us. But I have sworn not to touch the apple again, to not look into its inner. Yet, by the end, what can one last look do? What harm can one last look do? And that's the end of the codex pages. It is a map of the entire world, but there are lands shown here that do not exist. Apparently they do exist. I imagine they've yet to be discovered, or rediscovered. How is this possible? Perhaps the vault will hold the answer. Do you see where it is then? No. It can't be. The vault. It looks like the vault is in Roma, then the Spaniard. This is why he became Pope. Now I understand. It's not the vault alone he's gained access to, but the staff as well. What staff? The Codex always spoke of two keys. Two pieces Did of it? Eden needed to open the vault. One is the apple. And the other is the staff. The papal staff is the second piece of Eden. For years, no, decades, we've sought these answers. And now, at last, we have them. But so too could the Spaniard. And if he does... If he finds a way into the vault, its contents will make the apple seem a trifling thing. I must go to Roma and find the vault. Sorry. What are the rest of you? We'll do what we do best. Cause some trouble in the city, giving you the freedom to conduct your search. Just let me know when you are ready, Nipote. So I could just have done this, then gone and do all the missions in, Flo in Venice. And then I could have There's a memory in Florence. Now I'm intrigued. Might be a uh, red herring, but. Let's see. And the reason I got Altair's armor is because it is canon that he has it on in the vault in Rome. As in the beginning of Brotherhood he has it on. Right, I'm in Florence. Uh, 
And now there's no memory here. Awesome. Oh wait, it might not be Florence, it might be another path between? I don't know. I don't know. Let's because I've never seen that before, it might be a glitch. Oh wait, no. There's no path between Florence and Monterjone, so Yeah. That is glitchy. Because I've done everything except for collecting the things. Let's go to Rome. Roma beckons Ezio. Let me know when you are ready to depart. Do you really want to go to Rome? I do. But I do. I do, I do, I do, I do, I do. Boy. Don't know if you need to kill anyone here. Maybe you do. Hey, you're supposed to stand here.
Attack him! No need. Should probably have restocked my supplies before I left. Ah, I'm good. I don't think you can actually be here in Brotherhood. I'm not sure. No, you haven't. I'm trying to disarm you. Any last words? No time yet. It's no risky strike. Wait for a good opening. Come on then. Ready. Ready. Just like that bright in Alba, Capito. Only cowards fight in a hood. No, no. no. Wait for a good opening. <laughs> I'll send you to your grave. I don't know what I'm doing. Any last words?
That was a good thing. Took a lot of time. Assassino! Assassino! That was convenient. Stop throwing stones at me! Oh my god, can you stop, please? No, it's not me. You're seeing things. gonna end with me being wanted. I think there's no way to prevent that from happening. I think. Opening. 
For goodness sake, let me do the thing. Why are you throwing stones? Can't wait to see your organs gently steaming in the sunlight. Die! Die! This Get one him. is coming. Somehow I remember this being a lot faster than this. Oh well. Yeah. Remain undetected while being notorious. Thank you. That's a great advice. Where did he go? There is.
Danazione, too hot for me. You have speed to get caught in the middle. Whatever this is about, leave me out of it, please! No, please, don't kill me! Right. Whatever I did to deserve this punishment, I'm sorry! Trust me, to get caught in the middle! Credo in deum, patrem omnipotentem, factorem celi et... The six... Sixteen capital? No shovel. I don't know. This is before the. Uh, ceiling was painted. Qui propter nos homines et propter nostram salutem descendit de celis. Et incarnatus est de Spiritus Sancto ex Maria Virgine et homo factus est. Crucifixus et siam pro nobis. Sub pontio passus et sepultus est. The cool thing is, if you are in the white an impressive power, this. suit, but the original, to save you, all of the clones are white, time. the clothing. But in this, when you have the Altair armor, they are all different colors. You cannot stop me! 
I can and I will. No, you will not take this from me. It's finished, Rodrigo. Lay down your arms, and I will make sure the end comes swiftly. Really, Ezio? And would you give up so easily were it the other way around? Why don't we find out? I think my first time I play this, that battle was so hard. So difficult, but now it was more difficult to get there than to actually beat him. This looks very futuristic. What is this place? Can't... Why can't I... Artifacts. No more. Hi, John. Let us see what you are made of, old man. All right, then. If that's how you want to play it. What do you even want with the vault, Rodrigo? Don't you know what lies within? Or do you mean to tell me the great and powerful assassins didn't figure it out? Figure what out? God. It's God that dwells within. You expect me to believe that God lives beneath Il Vaticano? A more logical location than a kingdom in a cloud, don't you think? Surrounded by singing angels and cherubim. Makes for a lovely image. But the truth is far more interesting. Let's say I was to believe you. What do you think you'll do when you open that door? I don't care. It's not approval I'm after. Just the power. And you think you'll give it She's up? She's fun. Whatever lies beyond that wall won't be able to resist the staff and apple. They were made for felling gods. God is meant to be all-knowing. All-powerful. You think a couple of ancient relics can harm him? You know nothing, boy. You take your image of the creators from an ancient book. A book, mind you, written by men. You are the Pope, and yet you dismiss the central text of your faith. Cupcake. <laughs> are you well, that's naive? wrong. I became Pope because it gave the me The Swedish for cupcake is power. called cupcake. You think I believe a single goddamn word of that ridiculous book? It's all lies and superstition, just like every other religious tract written over the past ten thousand years. Or nothing.
I, are you finished? Muffin. Muffin. You can't. You Spell can't. Li just like Muffin. It's my destiny. Mine. I am the prophet. You never were. Get it over with then. No. Killing you won't bring my family back. I'm done. Nulla è reale, tutto è lecito. Requiescat in, in pace. Well, where have we translated cupcake to Ustbudle? Cheese bun. Really? It's nothing in common. Yeah, the it hasn't aged well graphically at all. <clears throat> and this is just a remaster. Not a good one. I never had a cheese bun, I think. Or if that is what I think it is, then yeah, maybe. Greetings, yeah. Prophet. It is good you have come. Let us see it. To give thanks. Bark, yeah. We must speak. She looks more yellow than she did in. It was Minerva. Before that, Mulva and Mera. And on and on. The others, too. Juno, who was before called Uni. Jupiter, who was before called Tinia. Poor dog. No. <laughs> no, not God. We simply came before. Even when we walked the world, your kind struggled to understand our existence. We were more advanced in time. Your minds were not yet ready. Still not. Maybe never. No matter. You may not comprehend us. But you will comprehend our warning. You must. None of what you are saying makes sense. Our words are not meant for you. What are you talking about? There is no one else here. Enough. I do not wish to speak with you, but through you. You are the prophet. You've played your part. You anchor him, but please be silent, that we may commune. Listen. When we were still flesh, and our home still whole, your kind betrayed us. We who made you. We who gave you life. We were strong, but you were many. And both of us craved war. So busy were we with earthly concerns, we failed to notice the heavens. And by the time we did, the world burned until naught remained but ash. It should have ended then and there. But we built you in our own image. We built you to survive. And so we did. Few were our numbers. Your kind and mine. It took sacrifice, strength, compassion, but we rebuilt. 
Position, John. The rest is up to you, Desmond. What? Who is Desmond? I don't understand. Please wait. I have so many questions. Now, in the novelization of this game, uh, the there's no fuck? animus. This just in the past. So, when she does this speech. She let left. She does not say Desmond, but Ezio is just as confuzzled. Oh, sorry. There's only about ten minutes until I Need get... Need all of my equipment. Ready to go before they do. Desmond! Yeah, yeah. All right, Sean, I need you and Rebecca to get everything in here packed up and loaded into the truck. You and I will deal with the Templars. What, they're here? It was only a matter of time before they discovered us. To be honest, I'm surprised it took them as long as it did. Let's go. Amazing how preserved the bracer is. So, what's the plan? We ditch this place and then what? There's another safe house. We've got company. The truck's just up ahead. Mr. Miles, this is an unexpectedly pleasant turn of events. And here I thought I'd have to waste more men on it. Kind of you to save me the trouble. What do you want, Vidic? For you to come home. We miss you terribly. There's still so much work for us to do together. It's not happening, Warren. You continue to disappoint in every conceivable well, way. One ha doesn't have to understand everything, I John. I saved your life once. Do you remember? And this is how you repay me? You saved me so you could keep experimenting on people, destroying their lives. And for what? Oh, this tired argument again. As I recall, you were there, at my side, every step of the way. Their blood is on your hands just as much as mine. You need to stop him. I'm on it. Where are we going? Come on. Come on then. Hi Bill.
Uh-oh, Doc. Looks like it's just you and me now. Enjoy your victory, Mr. Miles. Temporary as it is. Desmond, we have to go! There you are. Come on. Help Lucy into the van. Hurry, Desmond. We need to go. You'll have your turn, Desmond. Warren's gonna get what he deserves. I promise. So what now? Where are we headed? There's a cabin up north. We should be safe there. At least for a little while. I have to analyze those tapes from your session. Figure out what's happening. And then what? Here we go. I've got you all hooked up. Got a long drive ahead of us. Figured you might want to play around with the Animus on the way. All right, but I got some questions first. I mean, what the hell was that? The vault? John was catching what up on some well deserved sleep. The Templars aren't our biggest threat. Not by a long shot. So what? The sun is? What's it gonna do? Cook the earth? I doubt it, but I don't know. There's been some speculation that the Earth's magnetic field is weakening. A sufficiently strong flare could flip the poles and cause a geomagnetic reversal. It's all theoretical, but if it happens, Swedish the planet could become geologically unstable. Very unstable. It's meant to be the stuff of pseudoscience, but clearly something catastrophic happened to the people of the first civilization. But that woman, what was her name? Minerva, was it? She seemed to think we were due for a second round. So either way, we're fucked. I don't know yet. We'll keep reviewing the tapes. And you can keep digging through your memories. Maybe there's more to discover. All right. Guess I better get started. My favorite tune of the Assassin's Creed series. And I'm so happy that they have returned to it in the later games. I really wish they would have had, had it in the movie as well, but they didn't because the movie was crap in all ways. But it is canon, so story-wise it's okay, I guess, but execution-wise it's not. If they were to make another Assassin's Creed movie, which I doubt they ever will, it should be 70-30 in past and present. Like 70% of the movie should be in the past with a coherent narrative and not split up and 30% should be in the present. Just to have a modern part of it. We don't need to see every time a person goes into the anime. And it doesn't have to have such implications in the present as well. 
But I doubt we will see an Assassin's Creed 2 movie. Hi Brandon. There are actually more movies planned for Assassin's Creed. Are they endless? I think they do end. If you see a name go by twice, John, let me know and I will stop. But there are a lot of people involved in making this game, so... It is to be expected. And also let me wind down and talk. Game credits are interminable. Does that mean that I can quit them at any time? Is that what you mean by that? Because I know I can't. I think I know how to pronounce that name, but I'm not sure. Because I know it's... Uh, I think it's Nguyen? No. Nguyen. Nguyen. No, I'm not gonna butcher that. Local heroes. <laughs> okay. Yeah, that's because they have to have the development team and the like CEO and everything, the entire company basically, or the hierarchy structure and the devs. And then they have to have the producers. And then they have to have the translators, and the testers, and the voice cast. Fritjof Ulsson. Rope Wobbler Mangrove, yeah. Noyen, Noyen, Bullying. It's a swallow sound, I think. Who's to say he's left, John? Sven Lemkin. No, it must be German. But in, I think, my favorite tunes of the Assassin's Creed series is Earth or Ezio's Family from Assassin's Creed 2. The chase theme from Brotherhood because it's so intense and fun. The Revelation it's something it's called something in Revelations anyway. The main theme in three is pretty good. Of course you do, Bill. You're the linguistic... You're the linguist of the... group. 
family, community. Oh, am I now? It's just that you are, when you are being lovely, John, I'm being suspicious because you're not lovely by default. That's fine. Some might say that's an alcoholic, Brendan. Or the behavior of an alcoholic. I think we're in, nearing the end of the uh, credits. It's a uh, ad quote. It's uh, the same bot as Rage. So it's ad quote in one word. Bad quote. <laughs> Goodness. Thank you, John. Ooh, eight quotes. I'm catching up to Johnny. I'm not. So <clears throat> now we're done with the story. We can just explore. I am keeping a record of your cruelties. Well, someone has to. So these are all my victims. I think this is... Yeah, this, that's Rodrigo Borgia. Started here. With the fat dude. And the brat. And that guy, and the brat's dad, and the people, then the Venice guys, and the DLC dudes. Of Ezio, why do you have naughty pictures of Ezio and don't post them in the chat, please? trying to keep my stream family friendly. No, I'm not. I mean, this is violent game. This is anything but family friendly. Mm. Naughty man. See you later, Bill. Salute, Claudia. You here to look at the book? So we... I've done 83% of the villa, I've done all the renovations and stuff. I've not done all the collecting. I'm missing five paintings? From where? Huh? Alright. 
and I'm missing one piece of every equipment, every armor. It's 22 weapons. A presto, Ezio. Yeah, my cruelties are facts. So, for good, stop walking in front of me. So let's buy these. Weapons. That should do, I hope. And please come back often. I don't really like how this looks. Why am I wearing the leather armor? I'm wearing all the leather set plus the best chest piece. I guess you can sort of mix, but I don't know. So now I have all the armor. Go pick my sword. Love you too, Brandon. Is this Altair's? Yeah. So I am. Done, I think. I still have all the feathers to collect and five paintings to buy. Where the hell are those paintings? Um, but I think I'm gonna do that around free time. Uh, next, I will play Brotherhood, I think. Which is on this. I do not need to s close the game to start Brotherhood, but don't think I want to stream. I, I want to stop the stream and restart it, but it's almost five o'clock here. I don't have been streaming for three hours almost. So I think I am done for the day. I have been thinking about doing like challenge runs of uh, this game or maybe Brotherhood. I think this game might be easier because it's more straightforward. You, only, you can only do the you can do only the story missions without the side stuff, like doing. The game without getting any armor except the ones you have to get. Uh, 
doing it with a specific weapon or doing it by without using any of the synchronization spots except the ones you have to in the story missions but I don't know maybe in the future I will finish the collection first and that's two more games so I might start Brotherhood on Monday I think Uh, still a few places I haven't been in. What are the secret places? There are three secret places that I haven't discovered yet, but I have no idea what they are. I will figure that out. That's the place between Florence and Forley, I think. But yeah, I will be back with Assassin's Creed Brotherhood on Monday. That will be fun. That is, I think that is my favorite of this of the classic Assassin's Creed games actually, rather than two. So that will be an interesting playthrough of me having rose tinted glasses and then, yeah. Thank you for stopping by, John, and thank you, Brendan, Bill, and Rick Diddy for the follow and. Also, Blackout Hero for saying hello. And thank you everyone who lurked and whatnot. I will be seeing you later. Bye. Adieu.